already are incredible souls, incredible energies. And to hear the feedback that you got tonight was absolutely amazing. How do you feel right now? Cloud nine. Yeah. Cloud nine. <laughs> Above cloud nine. Whatever there is, we're just overwhelmed and yes. grateful. I love that you say that. And you guys are just so gracious and still so humble about it. Um, so something for you. Do you, how, how did you feel hearing those first roars of applause in the beginning when you did that group piece? Because I know for me, I was like... Oh my gosh. First of all, Travis is a genius. The way he creates is what makes him a genius. He just yeah. doesn't choreograph. The, he's incredible. And just that was our first moment as the top 10, like yeah. not top 20, top 10. So that really definitely pulled us together. And it was actually funny in the dance. Like we always ended up kind of next to each other, holding on to each other yeah. somehow, some way. Crazy. Yep. So That's there's awesome. that. <laughs> you guys ended up getting connected together in that routine. Yeah. So fun. Okay, so nerves. Were you incredibly nervous? Were you... But I mean, obviously, it's to the point where you could focus. Yeah. So tell me how you felt about that. How do you deal with that? Do you breathe together? Do you tell each other something? Do you do your handshake? Yeah. Uh, definitely all of the above. Uh, it's all about... Honestly, besides all the talking, you know, calming down, it's just all about looking into each other's eyes and just realizing where we are and what we're doing. <laughs> Honestly, it's just about um, taking a breath, relaxing. Mm -hmm. And yeah, nerves definitely there, but we made it work for us, not against us. Yes. Mm -hmm. Definitely use that as the fuel for the night. And yeah. I think it worked. I remember um, I was telling Twitch earlier this. To, he, I told him this. He told me because he was my first the first year they did All Stars. Mm -hmm. He was my All Star. And oh, yeah, right? Crazy. Right. I know. Oh, and just, right. I remember him telling me before we went on, he was like, the only thing we're going to worry about is connecting. And that's what you guys did. Mm -hmm. And I t I've taken that with me through everything else in life, um, yeah. dance, other things. Mm -hmm. um, is there something else that you do in terms of really staying authentic to yourselves? Mm -hmm. So whether that be journaling in your spare time, mm -hmm. whether that be taking a moment to meditate, whether that be, I don't know, um, watching YouTube yeah. videos, reading a yeah. book. It's actually funny because usually I like meditate by myself, but like having a partner now, like we just kind of do this thing where we're like, <laughs> and it like, it, wor it, it works, it yeah. works. It yeah. works. Yeah. yeah. And like, that connection. and you'd Definitely. think it'd be, but it feels so genuine. Yeah. So like, I think that's why like this is working so well. I love it. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, definitely. It's not, we're not doing this just because just it looks like a movie thing. <laughs> it honestly helps us in the performance, the contemporary that we did. I had to hold her for a long time and we just had to stare down and mm -hmm. yes. if just exchange of energy and mm -hmm. that's what really helped us. What is going through your mind when you're on stage together? Are there any, is there anything that stands out that you're like, oh my gosh, I remember this moment that we had to look at each other or that mo like in your hip hop pieces, there are moments where you guys are definitely connecting. Yeah, I think, I think the, the biggest thing that stands out is her. It's all about focusing on your partner. It is a performance and we perform mm -hmm. for the crowd. But it's all about feeling each other yes, and yeah. just having fun. Honestly, the hip hop piece was all about having so fun, much and just fun, being so lost in the fun. sauce, yeah. and just yeah, y'all were saucy tonight. Saucy, I felt that definitely. Oh my gosh! Any embarrassing stories? One last question. This is on stage <laughs> ever, ever in your life. Oh, ever in your life? Yeah. Oh, okay, you ever in my life? Yeah. No, you go first. I have to think. I, I have to think too. Ah, oh. Okay. Um. Um. I know for me, this is embarrassing. Definitely underwear shown when there was like, like oh, things like that. 100. So fourth grade, one of my first like competitions, granny panties, flowers, just like hanging out. We were there. It happened. No problem. Yep. Deal with just it, you all out. out. You're welcome. Mm. Like, <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know if this is definitely yes. not the most embarrassing. I'm sure I've done something more embarrassing, but it just popped in my head right away. So I was taking this class back in Ukraine and there was this girl, so we were stretching or something like that. And she was laying, so we were in lines and she was in front of me and I was behind her. And the part of the stretch was we we're on the floor and we we're like doing something with our legs and I kicked her in the head. And I really liked her, I was, you know, she was pretty, I really liked her and I'm like, <laughs> no, I was like, oh yeah. You ruined it. <laughs> you guys. Oh my gosh, I love it. Thank you so much for sharing that. You guys are incredible. We cannot wait to see where you grow from here because y'all were already up here. Congratulations. Thank you. Living it, living it, living it. And Thank you so much. And continually, yes. Be present in it. Um, you guys are amazing. Congratulations. And bye. Thank you. Oh, oh, wait. No. Yes. No. Vote. Yes. <laughs> vote. Make sure you vote. Hello. Hey. Slavacy. 60 times. 60 times. 30, 20 30, on 20, each. 20, 40.
Did you 2020, know? Whatever, whatever you, you want. want. You got it. Yeah, it's funny. <laughs> Love it, you guys.